Oh, yes. Oh, yes, are we here? And are we spoken? Are we spoken? Well, let's not less. Let's not waste any time. What the fuck are you talking about? Um, look. Donald Trump ain't a great candidate, but he's better than yours. Yeah, what the fuck do you know about it, Emma Vaglin? You've never had to live it were a day in the real world in your entire fucking pampered life. Of course, it is really obvious why Sam Cedar would have chosen you. Because y'all just exist in echo chambers. And y'all, despite your abhorrence of capitalism, don't have to look at the food bill at the grocery store. Alright, one second. Alright, hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait a minute. Now we should be good. Mm. And we'll see if I'm back. I probably just fucked myself, but uh, whatever. Oh, for Christ's sakes, I gotta pay. I'll be right back. You know, it was a time when we used to meet evil on the battlefield, and guess what we did to it? We killed it! Divine evil. Because there's a lot of shit in the Bible that I would consider evil. Oh, I'm not in a very good mood tonight. There's a lot of shit in that fucking book. In that fucking book called the fucking Holy Bible! That I would consider evil! Just saying! We didn't quibble about it. We didn't argue about it. We didn't fight about it. We killed it! No, you didn't! Because you're living in the first secular nation in history! You dumb black motherfucker! Actually, it was Japan hitting us and then Hitler declaring war on us that got us to fight the Nazis. Had Hitler never declared war on us, we wouldn't have entered the, the European theater. Did you get that, black ass? Hey, black ass. I I don't know if your 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 if your school had history books, but. And I'm in a bad fucking mood. Our enemies. Probably because they're sitting there uttering in stupidity. Um, the only reason Hitler. The only reason we killed not they they had to declare war on yeah. All right, do we really want to go down the list of all the people the socialists and the communists have killed? We can start any time. By the way, Hitler was a fucking socialist! Claims he's going you know what? I'm already pissed off anyway, so fuck it. I'm already pissed off because I had a, well, whatever. 
I suppose it's private, private family matters, but let's just say I, uh, at some point I'm going to be having a uh, massive battle with my fucking cunt of a sister. Certain elements of this I have questions about, but let's get to the nitty gritty. Let's get to the details. So as the Democratic nominee by mid-July, and then announce the system of uh, with the backing and replacement, they wanna have like an actual primary process. Potential candidates would have a few days to throw their uh, respective hats. Anna, sweetie, sweetheart. Do you know Trump's gonna win? You know Trump's gonna fucking win. 2020, and Donald Trump is on track to lose. Why? Tim, I think the gap is so bad this time. He's gonna win. And look, I don't like... I don't like the GOP. I don't like the DFL. But at the end of the day, I think there's enough pissed off votes to counteract. The squirrely machines. Want to need a rehab? Cause I'm tired. I need a rehab cause I cooked three dishes before I got on this thing. Roosters. Hello, Iron Gullet. What's up, man? You doing okay? I'm doing fine. I mean, you seem pretty fucked up for the middle of the day. If anything, I'm just tired, so what's your point? What's your question? What? Is there something you want to talk about? Not really. You want to talk about The Sopranos? Not really. You want to talk about guns? No. Nope. Why'd you let me in? You called me. You opened the lines. Yeah, and you called me. Well... Any, okay, any, since you since you brought it up, why uh, are you mad at your sister? That's between me and her. I mean, you got on the internet and started talking about it. Doesn't matter. Oh, God. All right, bro, Hicks. Keep in mind you're on a short leash. Go. All right, sir, Jack. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Not too damn bad. Good, good, good. So, uh, why do you think Trump will win in November? I don't know. All the polling seems to think he will, and... Just, you know, your head above water things, yeah. All the polling seems to think a Trump victory. What well, you you think he'll win based on polls from four years ago? No, I think he'll win on polls based right now. Mm-hmm. And the ones that I mentioned from four years ago, it was a nail biter between Trump and Biden. On and listen. Yeah, well, I'm sorry. Old people have to die. Now. I'm sorry your grandpa died, but he had to go. Really? I wow. had to say goodbye, goodbye to all my grandparents. You, you are just like one little miserable fucked up piece of shit, huh? Is it not the end of all grandparents where grandchildren have to say goodbye? Is that not the end? I mean, yes, factually, 
Of course. I'm not going to deny that. Okay. So if they get COVID and that causes their death, then that was just the natural course of life. Not a wow. disease. You really are. A okay. You say you know who I am. Who am I? Doesn't matter. Okay, so it doesn't matter. Let's move on then. All right. You're done. Iron Gullet, I said remove yourself. I did. I'm back. I, I need to ask you something. Guess what? Iron Gullet, you come back in one more time. I'm banning your ass. Okay, not a problem. You know, I have a record of you doing this. And in that record, I can just go in and just ban your ass. You can I just... asked you to not do something, and you did it. For that. Oh, the little bitch boy runs away. I don't you... I ain't gonna just take your fucking punishment. I ain't gonna tell you what. I'll let you say anything you want to me as long as you're a man enough to stand there and take your punishment. What's my punishment? Your punishment is you're done. Once again, runs away like a coward. Come on, Iron Gullet. I thought you were more of a man than I was. You need to learn how to get Hello, Power Falcon. Uh, hello, Dave. <clears throat> um, I was I was going to bring up, up how the fact that Biden is now. Granted, I haven't seen it yet, but, but Biden is set to speak at the NATO conference, and it's highly critical okay. you know what you know what i mean no i, mean, I it, really don't okay sorry <clears throat> it's worse and they can't replace her with newsome because as you said the the leftist would freak out Yeah, yes they would. Yes they would indeed. I'm sorry. Do you think Trump could? Sir, how many states do you think Trump could win? Of the ones that, of the of the ones that you said should not be in play. Unless something changes, probably two or three. Look, I I, 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 know, I I know I know. I have a lot of people wanting to talk to me, so I'm um, all right. Um, music combo, what the fuck you want? Hello again, Dave. Hello, you little smiling little shit. What do you want? How do you How do you know I'm smiling? I so. gather that from general knowledge of little piss ants like you. That have never been in a fight in their damn life. I I, th I thought I was a beta male, not a not a ant. So okay. You ever been in a fight? Uh, no, not a physical fight. Why? Why would I? Why would I? Like. Explains what a reason, lot. What reason would I have needed to get into a physical altercation in my life? <laughs> To know your, to, to test yourself. To know the glories of combat. So. Never been in a fucking fight. Really? Really? Why? Not not a boxing match, not a kickboxing match, not a sparring session, not a nothing? You've never Dave. actually thrown a punch against anyone else? Dave, listen to my voice. Do you think I could win a fucking brawl? <laughs> Do you think it's I can not a brawl? It's a contest with <laughs> rules. What I'm, 
so wait, why are you asking me if I've ever been in oh, a fight before again? God. Oh, God. You've never been in a fight before. N no. I haven't. And you want to instruct young men on their lives. I'm not a man. I don't tell what them. What are how to you live their then? Life. I'm an NB. I'm non binary. No, you're a fucking man. You're a pathetic excuse for a man, but you're a man. Okay, if you. So if you think I'm Do a man. Do you pathetic... pee standing up? No, I pee sitting down. Okay. When pee comes out, does it come out of dick or vagina? It, it comes out of the bottom half of my body? <laughs> like, does babe. it come out of a dick or a vagina? Third option. There is Can no I? third option! The third option is, is, is I stick firecrackers to your balls. But into your nutsack, I blow your balls all over your pants. Why are you obsessed with my balls? When you sit down to pee, which is pretty pathetic even for a trans male, does the goddamn piss come out of a fucking? Because I'm real. I, I want to realize how really pathetic you really are. It comes out of my urinary tract. Now, does your urinary tract a bit of a hose or a bit of a hydrant? What? I. Do you have Why a Why am I being interrogated about this? Or a vagina? Does it matter? Why yes. does it matter? Matters quite a lot. You're right. I'm not Dave, masculine. I'm not you, trying to you, take you that you away still, from men. You still, and I, I, I've, I've seen you in real life, so I know you have a dick. Okay. Uh, it's just to kind of quantify everything. And again, and again, if I had to put you in a fight, I would with lose the, with the UFC pound for pound women's <laughs> champion. I would lose. I no, you'd win. You, you, you send yourself on the. And, and I would, and I would bet on you to win, and I'd bet heavily. <laughs> I'm talking about my own individual. Well, you gender. said you're weak. Uh, you said you're weak. Yeah, i yeah, just okay, saying. As a not male athletic. or as a person. As a person. <laughs> oh, so that means that. You're into drugs, alcohol, gambling. What? All the other, all the other things. Because a man's physical weakness, not being able to fight, that's a lot different than a female's ability not able to fight. Because females can't fight from the time they're fucking 22. At least against men. Wait, what? What? The age of 22? What's magical about being 22 years old? Okay, for any man age 70 to 20 would be able to kick the crap out of any woman age 70 to 20. So do you and think I'm that if a boy... That yes. if, so do you think that if a boy says that he's trans and he's a woman... He should compete against the girls? Because if you believe that contest is fair, I have some waterfront property to sell you in Florida. I mean, first of all, I, I thought that sports are inherently an unfair competition. No, they're not. No? They're not. You think sports are equitable? Like, everyone has the same physical strength? And, and, and moreover, HRT... You know what? You know what? No, no. Just, I have to piss on that. Are you out of your fucking mind? Why do you care so much about people's gender?
Why do you care so much about my gender? I don't believe it or not. I don't give a shit. You you have routinely told me, oh, you're not you're not a man because you pee standing up. Why does that matter to you? Why do you care if I pee standing as, up? Because you present as male and men pee standing up. You haven't up. seen me nowadays. You haven't seen me nowadays, sweetheart. Oh, fine, sweetie. If you pee but, standing down, fine. Fuck it, I don't care. Stay but... standing down. Not everything is about anything. you. No, I didn't say anything about that, call. I'm just talking about the the possibility. Not everything is fucking about you. Now shut the fuck up. Okay. <laughs> Mine is you are. What's a sigma male? A sigma male generally has the trace of the alpha, but he doesn't have a flying fuck about the opinions of any others. Okay, so, like, in what respect are you, like, traditionally alpha? Like, do you... Because, like, I, I don't see that you have, like, you know, kind of the assertive, normal male kind of attitude that You're, someone of your age normally you would, like a wife, you know, that kind of stuff. You don't see that I have assertive male traits? And also, no, you, don't don't, you don't see that I... Don't follow the typical male path or the typical alpha path. I mean, I, say, you know, you I also are going to sit there and say that I don't, I, I don't fucking provide for my pack. You're also going to sit there and say that I don't, you know. No offense, you don't have anyone to provide for, though. You, oh, presumably, I don't. You're just oh, I don't. Oh, I don't. Oh, yeah, I do you don't. Really? You know my fucking family? No, I have no idea. You know Who my fucking you, you know you know you know my fucking family? No, no. I I'm asking you a question, Dave. Like who do you provide for? More than you could know. But I'm I keep my shit intentionally vague. So do you keep it? So vague that you do have a wife then and like kids and do the whole Even tradition. If I did, I would never admit it to you. I mean, I, I, it's hardly a mystery when we're watching a man pass out drunk constantly. Like, I'd be more embarrassed about sharing that than whether or not I have a family. Maybe it's me personally, maybe it's a personal difference. Gee, how do you know I'm not broadcasting in a room that's specifically set up for that purpose? I mean, I think that that's probably an issue if you have a room that's dedicated to alcoholism. That's probably something you should. Accept. How do you know I'm not? How do you know I'm an alcoholic? Uh, based upon your drinking patterns on stream, it's not normal. Really, to I, I have also said pass out I have, drunk. I have, I, have, I have two lists of tasks, and the first list I never tarry from until I'm done. And that's the shit that I have to get done sober. I mean, yeah, you're what, a what, what, what is, what is I didn't what say is, you weren't what a is wrong with me? Alcohol. What is wrong with me having, you know, beers now? Right now? Um, you're consuming at such a level that, you know, you're overweight. Oh, 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 cause, fatty oh, liver. Oh, oh, you oh also God. just don't oh, no. generally keep oh, yourself Lord. in good health. That's, I mean in the sense that being unhealthy is probably a bad thing if you're providing for people. Oh, jeez. And... How are you so much better? I'm not an alcoholic. I'm not in poor health. I take care of my responsibilities without making histrionics. Really, 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 drinking really, problem. really. Hmm. Hmm. Yep. That's nice. I what I am I accusing? Why, you? why why am why am I not capable of providing for my family? Well, I'm just saying that I in terms of am. potential responsibilities, generally speaking, binge drinking alcoholics tend to no, fall no, short. No, 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 no. I told you I had two lists of tasks. One 
is the list of tasks that I can no longer do uh, if I have a sip of alcohol. And that list is always done before the second list of tasks, which is, you know, you know, grilling out at a barbecue. So please fucking explain to me. Why I mean, Dave, I, I cannot oh, provide fine. for my family. Please I explain. don't know. Like, again, I don't know that you have a family. To oh, provide you from, don't know. Oh, you don't know. No, 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 no. We're locked into this scenario. Please explain to me why I can't do it. Otherwise, you shut the fuck up and admit, admit that you're wrong. I never said that. You, I literally said you're a functional alcoholic. Please explain to me. Why I am not able to provide for my family or shut the fuck up and admit that you're wrong. I never made that claim, so yes, I don't know you what I'm supposed to. Yes, you fucking did. You literally said you cannot provide for your family. It's on tape, dude. We're being recorded. Then sit here and say that Dave Nornall can provide for his family. I we don't know if it. you can provide for your family at all. I okay, don't know then right. you're you're literally admitting the same thing. What am I admitting? You are literally admitting that I'm such a drunk, such an alcoholic that I can't provide for my family. Uh, no, Dave. I mean, you've talked yes, about Yes, you are! Money. You just literally did! No, I said that you were being irresponsible with respect to oh my by god keeping jesus yourself in that fucking health. christ those are different things just admit that dave Nornall can provide for his family i don't know I'll if you can you provide for your family you don't make a lot of money dave you seriously can't do it Dave, I don't know. You, you make, seriously by your own estimate, it. you make between I make more money than you, million. motherfucker! No, you don't. I make about three times as much money as you Oh, do. really? How much money do you make? I make $150,000 a year plus equity in my company. So you're probably a landlord. No, I'm not. Hmm. Smart thing. It's and the title. Of you're literally gonna sit there and tell me with everything that you granted me that and honestly I'm I'm getting to the point of just suing motherfuckers. You are welcome to sue me, but uh, my you're, parents you're, met seriously, law you're seriously going to say I can't provide for my family. I said I don't know if you can. You don't make very much money. I don't know much about your life. I make more than you. No, you don't, Dave. Yes, You've I do. Then on stream that you make between four and five grand, depending on how the month is going. You uh, said that. I lied. I, I, am very that, I am very, very, unco I am very uncomfortable talking about my actual earnings. Then why do you bully people over how much money you make? Why do you lord it over people if you're uncomfortable talking about your earnings? That's not usually how people I talk a talk a generalization. I mean, it's called also, that you're being also, very weaselly also, right also, now. Also, 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 generally, it's it's in the spirit of I want these people to get better. Why? I literally make cancer drugs for a living. Oh, like I'm trying great. to treat people great, with cancer. Great, great. That so does they, make so people they, better. So they, so they get cured for cancer, but they're left in a pit of self pity and shame. And then they go to a guy like me to get them out of the bed. Is that how you see yourself, Dave? The best friend I can be and be the best scientist I can be. Yeah, except your drugs leave people utterly devastated. No, my and drug depleted. is in clinical trials. Oh, really? Really? You're you're there with the drugs when they when they beat their cancer and they're destroyed. It's in clinical trials, David. It's not on the market yet. 
we haven't tested it on a clinical cohort. No, no, it's my point all is of the safety any, stuff any of the other, tolerated any, as any well as the, the standard other, of care. Any of the, you know, any of the, any of the others. It inhibit. You know what? If you knew so much about the human condition, you would know that your drug, it's, it's, It ain't you, assuming you, assuming you're right. Your drug isn't just something that you can just give and go. Yeah, I know. That's why we have specific clinical protocols. Oh, really? And at yeah, the that's the, like how you design and, and, clinical and trials. At the end of the end of the protocols, do they have anything about patient recovery? Do they have yeah, anything about? Do point. they have anything about? Do you want to talk know, about, like, yeah, we've about? talked about whether. I mean, listen, man, you sound like you're the expert. Can you tell me the relative pros of cons of using a clinical endpoint of progression free survival versus recurrence free survival? You're right. I can because I'm more concerned about the person. Dave, you're not even concerned about yourself. When's the last time you got? Here's the thing. Why? Again, you guys want to deliver the cure, and then it's guys like me that always have to pick them up. After no, it's been generally cured. either therapists or family. after they've been cured. No, it's generally not people like you. It's usually people who are more agreeable and compassionate. You're not no, very it's, agreeable. It's and compassionate. people like me. Sorry, you're kind of slurring a little bit. Could you repeat what it's you said? People like me. No, generally not, because again, you are pretty low on the agreeableness and compassion, which is fine. Like I'm not uh, the most agreeable person. Yet right? I'm the one. Sta- yet a guy like me is the one standing behind the bar. Pouring them the drink. Uh, again, you're trailing off because of the slurring. Can you repeat? I'm the one pouring the drink behind the bar. Okay. Like, I, I don't... There's not really a good correlation with mental health outcomes and going to uh, bar. Whatever. Like, in you've fact, had, like you've for had most... Your, you've had your time. Most conditions, you've had your fucking like, time. Have... For most conditions, alcohol is generally not good. It usually exacerbates most conditions. All right, you've had your time. All right, thanks, Dave. And actually, I gave you overtime. Okay. 